Hey, it's me Ricky from Neobot and today we are going to show you how you can make a open and closed UI animated, which is animated in Roblox Studio. Um, so the first thing we should do is create a new screen UI here and then add a button and a frame. And literally, um, actually, uh, basically edit, edit it. Um, there we go, uh, normal GUI right here, so now we are going to script it now, so yeah. Now let's insert a new script in the text button, so script parent, mouse button when click, but next function. This is for the clicking function, like when we click on this button, and it will activate the script. And then we want to do, like, we want to make this frame disappear first. So script parent parent frame visible is false. So this this frame will disappear once the script is run is running, like here. And then we when we click on this button and it appears back. So this is what we wanted script parent frame parent frame this goes true so now when we click on this button it will appear and we want this um, process animated so we can just firstly we can hide this frame yeah I think it's like here this Copy this position and you can move it back. Script parent parent frame position. I think it's factor 30. Nope, no. Yeah, here. And then we personally I will remove those blankets or whatever you call it. And now the frame should be up here and it disappeared so now we want when this button is clicked the frame move back to the center and then reappear again actually let me adjust the button i think it's like seven it should be like eight So now we can create a twin service script parent action. We can just local uh, main frame is script parent, parent frame for the convenience. And we can replace them with this main frame tween. I remember it's tween position. And then there is some instruction right here. We can just follow it. Uh, it's I think I think it's yeah we can just copy the position right here and then paste it here and then the pasting direction in out personally is thing style personally quad and the time I want it to be one second and then falls yep and it should be working. Like like this. And we can make the close thing right now. So we want to change the text script parent, just the text button. Text turn into close. Here, here we go. So 
Now we want to insert a new value. Local close false. What, what's this? Like here, here, here. Close the false, false, and then copy this, and then copy this. Remember, um, if closed is false, then do this. Else. And then at the close is true condition. Here at the close false false condition, and then um, and then we do this copy copy the whole thing, and then move this down here. Wait one second. I don't know. Is there a function that can make when the tween the tween animation is is ended? And it, yeah, I don't know. Is that I I heard of that, but I I kind of forgot. It's false. So let, let us try it. Close. Yeah. And then we can just add a text right here, and then open. Close. Oh, wait, what? Oh, okay. All right, here we go. But there is a tricky thing. We must do because if we spam on this, you know, if we spam on this, it will pretty much broken. So we have to, we have to add a very kind of tricky thing. That is, uh, maybe add a total cooldown on this thing. I assume. Local run local cooldown is false. I don't know will this work, it is probably won't work, but if it work, I'm happy. Cool down. Yes. Remember copy that though, don't just remove it like like that. If cooldown is false, then cooldown is true. Now you should be only able to run it run one once. Yep, you should be only you can run it once. So here we can add if cooldown is false then yep. um and then here we can do wait one second or two what safety cooldown turn into false. Here also we can do this. So there's a there's a two second cooldown right there. Here two second cooldown on the open and close. Yep. Actually it's fine for you to cut off the cooldown rate. Not gonna lie. It doesn't really kind of matter. Open, close, open, close, open, and close. There we go. If you want to add anything in this GUI, it's 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 fine. It's fine. Like a text label, a text label. Oh, I apologize. Text label, and it's still working really fine. Yep. Um, just add whatever you like here and that's all of today that's all for today actually I will I will make a last thing before the video end like here center the, the text here and then then make the background transparent and then make a text bigger 
and then change the font font text color and then add something really important here like all right that's all that's all for today the this is the that's all for the tutorial see ya